and uh, Turner's taken the free kick and hasn't kicked it straight, it hasn't carried the distance. The free kick again. Terry to take the free kick for the grab. It's not Terry, it's, uh, it's Blake uh, in possession and in control. I should imagine he should not, could not miss from here. Point blank range. And that's it. The second goal for Geelong coming up at the 10 minute mark. In the he had a perfect view of that. He was uh, nicely side on to it. And towards Blake. Oh, he's upended door. He's going to get a free kick, Blake. Against Andrews. Blake's free kick right in front. He's kicked one. And now it's his second. And Geelong scores. Yes, he does, in fact, go on to peak with a hand pass. Peak up towards Blake. And he takes the mark about 40 metres out from goal. And this is an absolute must for Geelong. That's straight. That's a goal. That's his third. Geelong's fourth. They're 4 5 29. Essendon 8 3 51. Turner feeding off him. The only way you get a kick today. And towards Big Blake. He's marked it. Only 20 metres out directly in front. He's kicked it. That's his fourth. Geelong sixth. Good probably kick. On to Neil. Neil. Now to Blake. Whitcomb, he thought about Whitcomb, chops his way out of trouble, lines up, fires, and has scored his fifth goal. Five goals straight to Rod Blake. Damien Drum, back with his skipper, Brian Peake, left booting at this time, but not really directly to this. He, he went for Blake. And his accuracy today is phenomenal. Five straight to uh, Rod Blake. And I'm sure he's uh, going to make it six straight. And he's two goals better than the Essendon top goal kickers. Rod Blake, top goal scorer of the match with six goals. Six of Geelong's ten.